welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be attempting to solve the Hanayama Cricket Puzzle which is a level two out of a possible six on the Hanayama difficulty scale. And obviously based on the game of cricket, I imagine that this one was, was made a very long time ago. The aim with this one is to separate sort of a six connected cricket bats with various things sort of stuck to them from a set of stumps with some bales on top and a few holes in the middle by the looks of it. Once we've separated it, we'll then attempt to reassemble it back into its original position. And then we will finally place it on the leaderboard, on my own leaderboard, based on how difficult I find it in comparison to all these other Hanayama puzzles that we've solved before. Let's get straight into it. Okay, so I have some bad news. This isn't me talking as I'm solving the cricket puzzle. This is me talking as I'm coming to edit this video. And for some reason, I've no idea how or why but the video that I have of me solving this puzzle is now just a little three minute snippet of the middle it's not the start of the puzzle where I first pick it up and try and figure it out it's not the end where I manage to separate the bats from the stumps it's yeah somewhere in the middle I've no idea why and for what I do have I'll, I'll show you that at the end but yeah unfortunately for today I mean this isn't a video that I can repeat because once you've done it once, like, you've done it, sort of thing. But in the same respect, it'd be weird if I just left it out completely and sort of just ignored the cricket puzzle and then all of a sudden you see a, a solution video a few weeks down the line. So I think I'll just, I'll talk through it briefly. I mean, you can see it on the, on the screen as you're watching it now. And yeah, essentially, it's those six bats all molded together and on the bats, some of them have got like little knobbly bits that you can see here. And then there's one bat that has a like two sets of stumps and you can see it just next to my thumb there at the bottom on the left hand side. And essentially the aim is to get it so that that bat with the stumps connected to it fits through. I mean you can see the middle, uh, the hole in the middle stump as of, the, uh, of the actual stumps. That just above it on the right hand side there's also a little groove that you can see just about there on the right hand side just above the the gap and the aim is to get the the bat that has the stumps on it and not the stumps sorry the bales i've been i've just been describing them as stumps the whole time so there's one bat that has two bales on it is what i'm talking about and you'll see the gap in the stumps the middle stump just above the hull so we flipped over to that side now and yeah, so the aim is to flip that bat over. You'll see it at the minute it's sort of the wrong way around. And the aim is to flip it over so that you can then line line those stumps up, line the bales up with the gaps in the stumps, and then you separate it from there. And you'll see it in reverse uh, when I put it back together. I put it back together quite quickly actually, which sort of shows you how long it took me to to take this one apart in the first place. But yeah, this description is as good as we're going to get, I'm afraid, at the minute. It's a shame. This is the first time it's ever happened. I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. Uh, but there is a few seconds, or like maybe 30 seconds or so, of me talking through solving this one. So you'll see that next. Then you'll see me put it back together, and then you'll see me place it on the leaderboard. All of which I had no idea that this happened. I apologize again. I won't let it happen again. And yeah, on we go. We can't quite get these two bits through from this direction, but that doesn't mean that we won't be able to get it through on the other side. And that bit there, we're just missing out on that bit there. What level difficulty is this again? This is a level two puzzle. I don't seem to have got anywhere yet, and there's quite a lot of variety of, of possible positions. I'm not sure now if I tried, if I tried both positions up here. I feel like this shouldn't be as difficult as I seem to be making it out to be. Uh, let's see, we can, we've got a possible variety of moves there, so we can swap from side to side. So we don't seem to be able to go there, but okay, right, that makes sense now. Come in, but we can't come... So we can go sort of like one move deep and then swap sides if if we're in the right position, but we can go too deep, two moves deep that is, and then move around from there. Ooh, and now it seems to be a little bit. So I need to find where I can go one move deep, 
and then swap sides. So if I put it back together in terms of order, this happened third last. So these two go in first. So maybe it was that one and then that one. And then we pass it through there. And then where do we go? Then I think it was maybe back out to this position. We somehow need to swap that over, which I think we've done there. And then I think that might be it. That position. Wait, let's check the box. I don't think I'm going to be able to tell from that position. Uh, so, yeah, for now, we've reassembled it. Well, I think the only way I'm going to be able to tell whether it, this is the right, uh, the original position is probably through uh, looking back at the start of the video of, of taking it apart. So I'll do that and yeah, then check back with you if I'm in the right position or not. So after a quick VAR check, this is the original cricket position and we have, yeah, now officially done the full thing, disassembled it, reassembled it much quicker than it took, oh, we were much quicker reassembling than we were disassembling, but yeah, very clever puzzle and done. So there we go, we managed to disassemble and then reassemble the cricket puzzle. Tougher than I expected, to be honest. There's there's lots of different options that you can be in, but I mean, eventually I found it that the secret is is that twist when you've only got that one piece connected to or that one bat connected to the the set of wickets. It's quite a it's quite a secret shady little move that one. As soon as you found that, it, it was relatively easy to, to, to go on from there. That was almost like a, the halfway point of, of turning the bats around. So you can then line up the bat that has the stumps connected to it to then disconnect it. Putting it back together, as soon as you found that sort of that twist, then it's relatively easy to get back to the, the original position. Although a hard part is actually remembering slash realizing where the original position is. But now we need to place it on the leader board now again we're not looking top half with this one we're definitely looking bottom half and i think this one's going to be quite a difficult one to place we'll do it to start with based on the previous puzzle that we solved which was the cubie puzzle in here so are we easier or harder than the cubie puzzle i don't think we are i think we're easier than the cubie We'll then skip to the next most recent puzzle that we've done in the medal. Are we easier or harder than the medal? And again, I think we're a little bit easier. So we're going to be definitely at bottom two shelves by the look of it. But saying that, I think the ring puzzle is the next one down. And I think it's harder than the ring puzzle. Or the ring two, oh, sorry, that is. Not, not the ring. I'm going to change my mind, actually. I think we're harder than the medal, come to think of it. So are we then harder than the keyhole puzzle? The Amor, the G and G. I think we're gonna sit between the Amor puzzle and the G and G puzzle. And there we go, we've disassembled, we've reassembled the cricket puzzle, and we've finally placed it on the leaderboard. Work done for today. Thank you very much for being here. Let me know what you think of the of the cricket puzzle in the comments below and if you want to see me solve any more of these hanayama puzzles all the step-by-step -step solutions to each and every one of them then be sure to click my face here to subscribe and i will see you next time peace